I have another project. Um, as you know, um, I haven't been able to do too much of anything lately because my parents are both in the hospital. I had one in the hospital and one in rehab. So now they've moved my dad into the rehab center where my mom is. So they are got a room for, um, right beside each other. They have separate rooms and they have strict orders that they're allowed to visit each other, but they're not supposed to overdo it because they have to do their exercises and they have to rest. So they let them eat lunch together and dinner together. And um, so that was good. I went over there yesterday to make sure everything was good. Um, they brought him Friday night, so he's doing a little bit better. But they did find a black mark on his foot, on his other foot. So hopefully they'll be able to get that under control. And everything else has been okay, just very hectic and busy. So now I got some time and I want to do, I've been wanting to do this project. So, I am got everything from Dollar Tree, and I'm going to show you what I have. Okay. Right, I'm just going to move you a little bit here. I'm not used to doing this. Let me see if you guys can see it. There we go. Okay, so hopefully you can see some stuff here. All right, so what you need, you need two of these lights here, okay? They're solar lights, and you can get them at Dollar Tree for a dollar. And then you take the things out, and you can turn them around, and you can use them. And we'll do this. I'm not going to pull the thing out. They have a, a, a little tab in there, and I'll show you later. There's a tab, but I'm not going to pull it out right yet. Then what I did, I got, it's a little um, wind thing, but I'm not going to cut this off. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh, excuse me. So I'm going to cut these off, and we're going to use the, oh, there you are, sorry. And we're going to use the little bug. And then I found this, and you really poke it into the ground. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut this off, and we're going to use this part. That's what we're going to use is this part. Okay? So hopefully you can see everything. I think you can pretty good. I want to make sure we're good. Um, I got a glue gun, but I also got my E6000 too. I'm probably going to use. So you're going to take all these tab things off here and wrap it up. And I'm going to do that. Um, take this all off. Oh my goodness, I hope I'm not catching anything. I think it's allergies. We've had so much rain lately, so uh, sneezing crazy. Okay, so we got this one off, and we'll just tear this one off here. We don't need this. Now, I'm going to use these in my pots that are up front. I haven't been able to do any gardening this year at all. All it does is rain, or I'm too busy, or something's going on, so... It's been crappy, but I'm going to put these out anyways, and hopefully I can get me some fall flowers. And what you're going to do, we're going to take this hook off here. We don't need it. And you're going to kind of, you're going to end up with it like that. That's what you're going to end up. Hopefully you can see it. See? Yeah. So, what we're going to do, we're going to clip this all off. And I got some of these here, so you don't need this part at all. So, I'm just going to, it's kind of like a hook, really. Um, and so, we're going to untwist this like a hook and take it off just like so. And we're going to do the same over here the best we can. Um, let me see. It would be cute just hanging it up. They are cute. And I got this at Dollar Tree, all of it, for a dollar each. So that's for 
for a dollar these things are really cute really it would be fine just putting them up but I got another idea for it instead if I can get this off uh, these things are kind of too big for this I need a smaller pair for this one anyway see if I can twist it up We got it. Okay, so we're gonna take that off. And I think that would be all right. What I'm gonna do, it's a very easy project. We're just gonna glue it. Hopefully, let me bring it up a little bit because I don't think you can see it all. There, so now we're just gonna try to glue this. So I'm gonna glue it underneath as much as I can so then and you could do it both ways if you wanted. Or you could kind of angle it maybe. I don't know. I think that would look cute maybe. That would look cute because it kind of sticks out a little bit. It looks like a bug on there, right? <laughs> I don't know. I might do it like that. Or you can do it down further if you want. But what the whole thing is is to get the light to glare through it so it looks pretty. Um, so let's try this and see if it will work. I'm going to put some glue on this. I'm going to crazy glue it first, and we'll just crazy glue this and see how well it works here. And kind of just put it where you want it. It doesn't have to be anything fancy. It's going to be for the garden. And I'm going to put some more glue on the inside here. I uh, hope you can see. I'm going to put glue in there because it kind of sticks out. They had different ones. And you go with maybe smaller ones or bigger ones. Um, you know. But I'm going to fill it in. And get it filled in there so it's good and tight. The best you can. And I'm going to do it on the other side too. So I'm going to push on it. That's what I'm doing. I'm pushing on it. You don't want to push on it too hard because you don't want to break it. And uh, I hope you can see what I'm doing. There we go. And we'll just go up and down with this like so. so. And Do it as neatly as possible as you want, can, <laughs> as you want, as you can. I'm going to hold it for a few seconds and let it sit. And, um, and see, you have your bug. You can tidy it up after it dries a little bit with the glue. Uh, I'm going to see how well this sticks. And if it doesn't stick too good, then I'll put the uh, other glue on there too. Um, but I think it might be all right. Just let it sit there and get it, get on there and do its thing. I'm still slipping a little bit though. Yeah, so you want to hold on to it and have it in its place where you want it. It's going to be cute. I hope so. I hope it'll look really pretty, really. Um, all my pots there. We'll just kind of let it dry. I'm going to let this one dry and we'll start the other one. Now this one, I just want this piece here. Now it's kind of big, but we can bring it down. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to glue it too, but I'm going to bring it down a little bit. And I'm going to cut it probably to this length here. That's all I'm going to do is just cut it right about there. This stuff's stronger than the other stuff. Ooh, I don't know if I can do this. It's really strong stuff. 
Wow, it's a dollar store. Good quality. <laughs> mm. I'm gonna have to use something else, find something else to use for this. Should be that, should be able to snap it right off, but it ain't doing it. I have to wiggle it. There we go, I got it. Need my, to eat my Wheaties. Okay, so I'm gonna do this one. It got glue on there. I'm gonna bring it down a little bit and it's gonna come down just a slight. And I'm gonna twist it so it will stay on there a little bit. This one's a little bit heavier. So I'm gonna twist it and I'm gonna put some glue on it first and then I'm gonna twist it around the pole a little bit. So let's try this. This is a little bit heavier, so I might, I think I'm going to try some of the E6000 on here. So, um, I know that it's going to stay pretty good. And hopefully it will. And I'll just kind of do both, a little bit of both here. And this stuff is amazing. I've never used it before until I started doing these projects. And then I was like, oh wow, this stuff is really good stuff. Whoa. Well, I kind of want it up a little bit. That's kind of what I want. I want it kind of up a little bit. It's going to have to kind of sit there for a few minutes, I think. And what we'll do is put some crazy glue and you can bend this a little bit too if you want it you know to kind of make it look like it's flying I'm going to put some crazy glue on the sides here why we got it there too so To both sides here. Hopefully you can see. Oh, I'm sorry. You can't see what I'm doing. That ain't gonna work, is it? Okay, there we go. This is better. And I'm kind of doing both sides here. I put that other stuff down. And then I'm gonna stick uh, some gray, this the hot glue gun in here too. So we have kind of both in there and hopefully I'll hold it real good once it dries. Oof, I'm getting this stuff everywhere. Never said I was a neat artist here. And it's kind of moving. Not that I wanted, but we'll have to hold it a little bit. Oh, that's cute. It's got marbles in there. Isn't that cute? Okay, as soon as it dries, oof, this is becoming a mess here. Okay, I'm gonna twist this on the back part here and twist it over just so it will have a little bit more support because this one is a big one. Ugh, it's not doing what I want it to do either. Now, grab all that. No, it failed. I have to redo it. Okay, let's redo this. No biggie. One thing about this stuff, you can do what you want. And I just want it a little bit on here. And then I'll twist it. Yeah. So let's try to see if we can clean this up a little bit. Mm-mm-mm. It's not wanting to do what I want it to do. No, no, no. It's got to go right there. That's where it needs to go, like that. And then I want to twist this around. So maybe I can get it twisted there and just let it dry. Hmm. I'm going to let this one dry <coughs> and leave it alone. And so I can fix it. Yeah. yeah, one good thing, at least this glue dries and you can always take it off and try it again, right? So it's not really harming anything too much. Well, 
as you can see, it didn't work the way I wanted it to, so it might be too big for it. So I might have to just bring it down onto the pole a little bit more, um, which will be fine. It'll probably be pretty that way too. So let's try it, and we'll try to clean this up a little bit. You don't want all that glue on there. And I see here. So I'll bring it down a little bit more. It's still going to hide. I'll bring it like that. And we'll try to do it that way. Okay. Let me see here. I'm going to bring it this way. So I already bent it that way. So. I'll we'll just stick some glue on here and let it do its thing. Leave it alone for a while. That's what I'll do. I was on for eight minutes. No one joined me. <coughs> well, one person did. It was me. Well, then you somebody was there. Nobody joined Shea Bear today. Guess everybody's busy. Yeah, it might be busy, relax, and it's a nice day, you know, it could be like it Sunday is Sunday. Sunday. Yeah. All right. Everybody's got things to do, I guess. That's okay. So I'm just going to let this sit for a few minutes and let it get hard, and hopefully it'll stay there. And I will let this rest, and then I'll come back when it dries. Now this one looks pretty good here. It looks pretty good. Seems to be sticking pretty good. Yeah, yeah. It's a little heavier. Oops, sorry. You weren't in the picture there. Now you are. So, anyways, that one's good. And we're gonna let this one dry, and we will be back. Hey everybody, Monkey is back and I have this one done. It looks like it's holding pretty pretty good. Oop, there we are. I got this one here. So it's holding really well. Um, I'm going to take the little tab out. That's what we need to do here on this one. Ugh, pull it out and we'll have to let the light get to it. And this one I had some trouble with it. Um, it's really heavy, so I had to really glue the crap out of it. And I'm hoping it holds. It seems to be. It's a little bit messy in the back, but no one's going to see it. There's the light there a little bit. So you can see the light on. So I already pulled the thing out. I had a hard time. I think it's because it was so heavy and so big. Um, I'd probably stay with the smaller ones at Dollar Tree than the bigger ones. Be easier. I'm going to stick them in my flower pots, and when it gets dark, I'm going to go out there and show you what they look like. So stay tuned. Okay guys, I'm outside and it is dark. I wanted you to be able to see my lights. Whoop, that light came on, so here you go. Isn't that pretty? And as soon as I get some flowers in there, I will, it'll even look prettier, I think. And here's the other one here. I do have a plant in this one. I moved one of my plants. It was being smothered, so my heather was kind of dying on me, so I'm trying to get it going. And I got a cactus in there that's halfway dying, so how you kill a cactus, I don't know. But I can do it. So anyways, I think they're really cute lights. And let me see if I can see far away a little bit. Yeah, kind of give you a thing here. And let's go back a little bit more. Let me turn that light off, and then we'll see. You can see it a little bit better. Uh, oh, I think it's going to be really cute here. Let me see here. Whoa! I can't get both in at the same time. There you go. Kind of gives you a little thing. 
So, cute, huh? They're really cute. Anyways, it was an easy project to do. Um, not too hard to do at all. And, um, you know, I, I just would stay with the, the lighter ones because the uh, heavy one here, the butterfly, it's cute, but it's really, really heavy. And it just, um, I think that's Bruno. Is that my Bruno? Yes, that's Bruno. See, there he is. He wanted my mommy doing out here. So anyways, I think they're pretty though. They look pretty nice. And you could do a bunch of them if you wanted to. You know, um, just do a couple of them and yeah. I like this one better. I think this one's cuter. Yeah, so. Anyways, that's that for now. And I have another project coming up. So I'm going to turn you around so you can see me a little bit. There we go. So anyways, I've been working on another project. But it's going to take a little bit. It's going to... So I'm going to put it all together. So it might be a week or two. We'll see how well it works. Anyways, uh, stay tuned. I have another one of my sleeve to come up. Um, and uh, so we'll go from there and Bruno says bye everyone can you see him there he is so he says bye too y'all have a great rest of the Sunday evening and we gotta go to work so we better go to bed bye y'all